guys welcome back to coding stuff and in this video we're gonna learn how you can subscribe to connectivity manager uh, network callbacks with with the help of live data so yeah first of all uh, I have created this empty project so what we'll do first we'll create one class and I'll name it as network manager cool and we'll pass context here so context and context this one and this will inherit from live data up type boolean and parenthesis as a constructor invocation and then we'll create one private var we'll name it as a connectivity manager and we'll initialize it with the help of context and dot application context dot get system services and then we need to pass context uh, let me just collapse the project view we need to pass context dot connectivity service as connectivity manager connectivity manager and i'll press alt control l and then we'll create one private val uh, network callbacks so network callback callback and we'll initialize it as an object of type connectivity manager dot network callback so in this we get a uh, multiple function to write such as on available on unavailable and on lost and many more so we are focused on on available and on unavailable and then on lost you can read more about these callbacks or other callbacks on the official documentation but for particularly this video i'm interested in these three functions all right so in this on available as we are inheriting from the live data we can just post the value so i'll write post value so in on available i'll pass true and in on unavailable i'll pass false and inside the on lost i'll pass post value false all right okay then we need to uh, register this network callback with this connectivity manager but we'll do that in another function i'll create another function which will be private one I'll name it as check network connectivity and right inside this first parameter I will create one network variable and this will come from connectivity manager dot active network again I'll have one check if this network is equals to null and then I'll I'll just post the value as a false again if this network is null so i'll post a false value to the live data if any active network is null all right then we need to use uh, we need to create one request builder so i'll write request builder and i'll initialize it with network request okay this one dot builder and we need to set some properties with this so i'll use dot apply and in this we'll write add capability first parameter this will be network capabilities dot net capability validate i'll duplicate this line and this time it will be dot net capability internet then we need to add uh, some transport type so add transport type and this time it will be network capabilities dot transport cellular so this one I'll duplicate this two times as I want transport Wi-Fi and I want transport Ethernet All right so request builder is done and important thing that we forget or i did but you didn't you need to add this uh, permission which is access network state in your manifest file all right 
so then we can just uh, subscribe or we can just add our network callback to this connectivity manager so dot register network callback and here we need to pass two parameters first one will be the request builder and then we can pass network callback okay yeah uh, so we didn't add dot build here so this is done so now we just need to call this function so where we will call this function so inside the live data we get two uh, function store right which is on active or on inactive and we also get get version but we are not using that so on active and on inactive cool so in on active what we'll do we'll call the function check network connectivity and in on inactive uh, we will just unregister that network callback so unregister and we need to pass network callback so all right this is done now what we need to do uh so inside the drawable i have added one drawable which is wi-fi as you can see this one in white screen and inside the resources values and themes i change action bar to no action bar and I changed status bar color to the black and then also I have added one custom dialog layout let me just walk you through it so this is material card view then constraint layout the logo of Wi-Fi and then the text view no internet connection all right so let's just go to the main activity and first of all what we'll do uh, I'll create one late in it where for dialog so we'll be we'll be showing dialog when there is no internet connectivity okay so then in on create we will initialize this dialog so this dialog equals to material alert dialog builder we'll be using material alert dialog builder here so we need to pass this as context then add a style i have added one style here which is material alert dialog round let me just walk you through it so it just uh, provides some you can see uh, its parent is again material alert dialog but we are just adding uh, corners to the dialog of 16 db as you can see cool so then over here we will set view to it so set view and here we can also pass the layout so we, know we want to pass our dot layout dot custom dialog this one dot set uh, cancelable will make it false and then we can just call create function on it cool so this dialog has been initialized now we need to initialize our network manager so val well, network manager this will be equals to network manager we need to pass the context so i'll pass this and then we can just subscribe to it so network manage manager dot observe pass this okay so we get it here as a boolean value which is uh, is network or not so here what we can do we can have a few conditions which will check if it is true and there will be else to it so if uh, the network connection is there what we'll do we'll have another f for if dialog is added or is showing so if a dialog is not showing we can just call dialog dot show and in here what we'll do if the dialog is showing dialog dot hide so i guess uh, we made one mistake all right we need to use not equals here so if it is false then we'll check if dialog is showing or not uh, because we want to show this dialog when there is no internet connectivity so when this is false we will check if dialog is showing or not if not then we will show it and else uh, if it is true if there is internet connectivity or if there is a network connectivity then we will check dialog is showing or not so if it, if it is showing then we will hide it alright so this is done so yeah everything is done uh, let's try to run the app so I will click on the run button so our app is installed and as you can see uh, I have connected to one Wi-Fi and 
this is blank so what I will do let me just uh, turn off the Wi-Fi all right as you can see no internet connection let me just uh, turn it on again so yeah as you can see this is working let me just again turn it off yeah no internet connection let me turn on my data so yeah there is a network connectivity and if i turn it off then no internet connection so we successfully subscribe uh, with the help of live data to connectivity manager but uh, this is not a perfect solution when you want to use uh, when you want to check if the connected uh, network has internet connection or not so for that case uh, you would definitely how to hit any other api which gives you some pings that way you can find out if the connected network has internet connection or not so yeah that's it for this video and do subscribe if you like the video thank you for watching